welcome to my youtube channel mechanical magic mechanical learning tutorials so today in this video i am talking about thermodynamic systems so basic definition of the thermodynamics as under it is defined as a quantity of matters or you can say region in space under consideration for analysis so basically thermodynamic system that will be into category of the three systems so in that case thermodynamics basically there is a one system and that will be having a boundary so boundary is separated that system from the surrounding so outside that will be surroundings so you can say system to surroundings or surrounding these systems there will be some amount of energy or you can say mass transfer so in the case of thermodynamic systems basically that will be having a three category open system closed system and third and that will be considering as a isolated systems so let us see first open system so in case of open system one of the examples over here for turbine and it will be like this so just you can see This is a symbol of the turbine. So you can write down over here turbine. So in the case of open systems, from here that will be heat and mass. entering to the system and that will be representing as a system boundary and with the heat and mass that will be entering into the system from that particular boundary and from this shaft or you can say that energy it will be converting into the rotation and that will be coming out from the that particular shaft so you can say that useful work and rest of the heat and mass that will be relieving from the another end so you can write down over here heat and mass living from the system so such kind of examples of the turbine that will be considering as a open system or you can say example of turbine so now you can also considering as a ic engine as a example an open systems but now i want to talking about a closed systems so in that case which is only energy transfer at its boundary sections so in case of open systems here heat and mass transfer is occurs but in the case of closed systems only energy transfer at its boundary regions so let's see one of the examples 
लाइक पिस्टन सिलेंडर अरेंजमेंट पिस्टन सिलेंडर अरेंजमेंट सो हियर देर इज अ वन सिलेंडर and here one piston that would be connected with the crank or you can say from which that will be getting the work so here you can write down piston and inside of that particular or you can say filling with the gas or you can say it will be the closed system so with the help of burner kind of arrangement that will be heated or you can say heat is supplied so generally energy is transfer or you can say heat in the form of energy so only heat is supplied to the systems and rest of the part here that will be considering as a surroundings and that would be considering as a system boundary so here by the increasing of a temperature you can say or in the form of heat energy so that will be increasing the pressure of the gas but there is no any kind of mass transfer during the process so in that case only energy transfer at its boundary so last one isolated systems or you can say perfectly insulated thermo flask so that will be the example of isolated system so in technical language you can say that neither mass transfer nor heat transfer during the or you can say at the system boundary so that will be considering as a isolated system so in simple way if you want to remember open system closed system so in the case of open systems that will be heat and mass both are transferring into the systems or you can say entering the systems and that will be leaving from the systems so that will be considering as a open systems so here it will be the example of the turbines in the case of closed systems so in the case of closed systems only energy transferred at its boundary regions so that will be the example of the piston cylinder arrangement of an ic engine you can considering as a closed systems and third one isolated system so that system that will be neitherly mass transfer from system to surroundings or surrounding to systems or not a energy is transferring from the system to surroundings and surrounding to systems 
so i think you understand there is basic knowledge about the thermodynamics or can say systems and surroundings and the one of the examples of the open system closed system and isolated systems so if you like it then subscribe and share thank you very much